So this is Tekka from Tekka.tumblr.com and today I will be posting a video guide um, on how to install Firefox 4 beta on Ubuntu or Debian or whatever Linux history you have. Um, now this is a follow up to the article I posted a few days ago and um, just wanted to give you guys a video tutorial to show you exactly how it works. Now, um, pretty much first thing you need to do is download Firefox 4. Firefox 4 beta. Um, you can easily find it by just googling it. Um, to be the first to but anyways, I've already downloaded it. It's right here. Now, after you download it, go ahead. First thing you want to do is a good extract. No extract here. All right. There we go. And there we go. And this is Firefox. All right. Good. And if you run it, that's probably because I'm running this in the background. But if you run it, yep, it loads Firefox 4 beta 11. Now, how do you get this? The big question is how do you get this to install like it would if you had it installed through Synaptic or whatnot? Um, answer is it's actually quite simple. Uh, first thing you will need to do is press Alt F2 and type in GKSU and then you Tylus, Natalus. Uh, now that's your file browser, okay? Click run. Prompt you for a password. Enter your password. Now I'll come up here, root file browser. You want to go click that little back button, click the disk, and head over to opt um where is it opt yep now um now as you can see i have some stuff installed here um personally you can install this i think in user share or user um user or other places but personally i like opt because it's nice and clean user share has a whole bunch of stuff already in it and use going up opt it's very clean now go ahead and Put the Firefox right in there. Okay. And uh, I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to rename it Firefox 4 Beta. And just don't put any spaces in there just for the sake of command line use it. Now, go inside of it. Next step, um, now that you have it put in the correct location, um, if you type in Firefox or Firefox 4 in the command line, like I will now. Nothing comes up. Um, now, here's how you get it so it will come up. Uh, first of all, find Firefox. Here, click, right click on it, click make link. It'll say link to Firefox. Drag this to your desktop or wherever and move this copy to the trash. Now, you want to go back. And go to USR bin. You know, load up. Take a little while to load up because there are a lot of files here. Meanwhile, while it's loading up, I want to go ahead and rename this Firefox or you know, Firefox 4 or Firefox Better or whatever. But anyways, keep in mind what you name it. Personally, I'm going to name it Firefox 4. I'm going to drag it back in here. I'm going to drag right in. Alright. Now, you're almost done. Um, now, if I type in Firefox 4, it will launch Firefox 4. Now, uh, you, you pretty much at this point have the whole thing installed. You can go and delete all this. You have the whole thing installed, but um, last thing is is getting a menu entry. Um, now, you can do this in one or two ways right click, edit menus, or type in. Alt F2 again, a la carte. Yeah, then it'll pop up the menu letter. Now go to internet and click new item, application, Firefox 4 beta, browse, and just enter Firefox 4, and um, the icon will. Should automatically pop up if it doesn't go here and go here. 
go up. Firefox for beta icons and the icon will be right here. Hunter and as far as the comment, oh, let's put, put the same comment as this. Yeah, browser web. Just to make it look professional. And boom, it's right there. And that's cool. Now if you go to the internet, hit Firefox for beta. It runs. And also I think if you click internet. Oh, uh, okay. It doesn't work that way. But anyways, yeah, that's pretty much how you install it. Um so far, the um, only downside I've seen to installing Firefox 4 is like uh, you like you just saw. If I have Firefox stable running like this, and say I want to run another instance of Firefox, I can't run Firefox 3.6 and Firefox 4 at the same time. At least not from the menu. Uh, let me try it this way. Yeah, you see it runs Firefox 2.6. Um, that's just one of little quirks. I don't know why it does that, but uh, but yeah, so that's how you install Firefox 4. And um, anyways, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, make sure to uh, visit me at techid.tumblr.com. Also, my Twitter at techid. And um, talk to you later.